What's up guys, Legend here, and today let's revisit Legends Road Super Saiyan Gohan. Now, they are actually returning a lot of events to close out the rest of this year, and his event I was looking forward to, kind of like the uh, Legends Road Zenkai Piccolo, he too is a very interesting character that I'm not sure why they took someone to return, unless they did give him a return, and I just didn't capitalize on it, which is probably what happened. So, I have him at 14 stars, and originally I had him at about 7 or 8, and I was thinking that if I ever do a revisit for this guy, I want to do it whenever I get him maxed out. So, I have the opportunity, and now he's maxed out. So, as stats-wise, 14 stars, pretty good, not that bad. They, they scream year 1 to mid-year 2. I don't remember when this guy released because it's been that long since they ever pumped out Legends Road units. But overall, I think he was a really fun character to use back in the day. And I remember a slight argument <laughs> with this unit, and it was between him and the blue Broly movie Gohan. Because they was like, their models are the same, I don't see the difference. Well, there is a difference. It's the hair model. and. Uh, I guess his shoes are different too, so there was a difference. And I, when I tell you that there was a whole argument over that, there was a whole argument. If I can find that argument, I will pull it up if I can. So, for him, his overall design was to really just support hybrids, even though they labeled him as a melee type. So, in a way, he was kind of a mix of both. But he felt like a support type more than he did a uh, melee type. Because his overall kit just does what I just said, you know, just basically buffs hybrid sands. And he also buffs Videl. I think he was supposed to buff the yellow Videl. Or any Videl. So, yeah. And to me, again, I'm not, under I'm not understanding why the devs kind of stopped giving these guys a Zenkai. And I feel like they need to go back to doing that. And if they do, if he's not next, then maybe the Yardrake Goku could be next. Who knows? So, overall, like I said, his kit is basically to support hybrid best that he can. He's also time-gated to extra damage to be good, which is not bad. So, here's the team. It's basically going to be him on hybrids with two Zenkai buffs. And I just noticed I have everyone on this team 14 stars. That's pretty awesome. <laughs> this is not a flex, I promise. This is not a flex. So, uh, yeah. No real expectations here. Just a slight revisit. See how well this guy aged and see if he's actually worthy of a Zenkai, which most likely he will be. So, uh, yeah. With all that said, jump right into it and see how well he's aged.
So, after all that, I gotta say, he's still a pretty good unit in terms of supporting the, the allies. But to me, I'm not sure why they made him feel like a support rather than a melee type. If you kind of take that into consideration, because his true damage is kind of locked behind him being time gated. So you have to wait literally 20 counts, 40 counts, up to 60 counts just for him to be, I guess, at his best. But it's cool that he comes in with card draw speed and a little bit of damage inflicted, so that's pretty good. But again, he feels like a support unit rather than he does a melee type. So you can kind of flex that to your abilities. It just depends on what you rather him do. And the Zenkai buffs and the support from the yellow Gohan, Gohan, the yellow Goten was pretty, was, was, it was there. I won't say it was, it was there. But overall, I feel like they didn't give him that, I guess, uh, melee based role that they was wanting. But it was pretty cool to see him actually go in and do some work, I guess. And the Zenkai buffs helped out, and as well as, like I said, the Goten buffs as well, too. But again, I'm not sure why they gave him that uh, gave him that responsibility in him being a melee when he's felt more of a support, for support type. But overall, I do think he's deserving of a Zenkai some point soon, but only time will tell because ain't no telling when they'll actually give us another Legends Road unit as well as a Legends Road Zenkai. And like I said, if you was to look back at all of those guys, I think the only ones that don't have a Zenkai is the Great Saiyan, the uh, Yardrat Goku, and him. I think the rest of them have one except for those three. So, oh well, what, what can you do? But, uh, but, but yeah, he's pretty good, pretty fun to use. And with all that said, till next time, peace.